with troubles of this life. But God has left it in his word. I couldn't believe what Pastor said it. But Psalm 46 and 1 says, God is our refuge and strength. A very present help. Very present help in trouble. Hallelujah. Y'all excuse me. I'm kind of getting excited already. Because he's a present help. A present help in trouble. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. But you see, something has happened in the church. See, a spirit has crept in the church. You understand what I'm saying? And it has come to deceive us in this hour. That because we are going through troubles and we're dealing with our circumstances, I can say circumstances, or whatever the case may be, it causes us to think that, oh yeah, we can come to church, we can clap our hands, we can do our little shout and dance. They call, see, I do a little, they call it the cool and water dip, but see, that's all right. But you can do your dip, you can do your dance, you can do whatever you want to do. But see, the, the spirit of crept in and it makes us think, oh, you know, well, I could be saved today. Tomorrow, I don't know. Right. I'm saved today. Uh -huh. Oh, child, God knows my heart. Uh -huh. The devil is a lie. God does know your heart. But the Bible says nothing but the pure in heart yeah. Yeah. shall see the Lord. Yeah. I better leave that alone, God. Lord. <laughs> yeah, God knows your heart already. Right. But only the pure in heart shall see the Lord. Hallelujah. Yeah. Thank you, Jesus. It makes us think that we can do all this kind of stuff. Yeah, I'm going to come to church. Yeah, you know. Uh -huh. Then the next day, uh -huh. what happens? You're back in the same mess you was in. Amen. As hard as my pastor, get up here. Woo! Be sweating. Yeah. <laughs> Listen. This is a true woman of God right here. Amen. I say this is a true woman of God. And she get up here and preach her heart out. But for us to just come, oh yeah, Pastor, you right, that's right. And then we get right back out the door and do the same thing God it, just was supposedly uh -huh. delivered us from. I better leave. I'm going to get out of there. I better leave that alone. Because see somebody going to get mad at me, I'm going to leave that alone. Jesus. He's trying to make us say that, yeah, God understands our heart, you know. Come on, come on. <laughs> but the Bible says in James 4 and 17, when we know what's right to do, and we don't do what's right, the Bible says it is a sin. Write it down to James 4 and 17, just in case you don't believe me. <laughs> Lord, have mercy. <laughs> 